Hello guys, welcome to my channel. I'm David. Today I'm gonna review something new. This is a watch that uh, I bought this uh, for the first time. Uh, a watch of this brand. It's called Soundflame. I did a little bit of research of this uh, brand. It is a sub brand of the watch company. J Axis, uh, which uh, uh, was established in 1987, so it's around uh, 36 years uh, now. Okay, this is the first time I bought is such a watch long uh, Seiko or Oriental or uh, Casio. So this is a quite a minor brand. Okay, this one is uh, made in Japan. Uh, a brand from Tokyo. There is a case. It, it says uh, Japanese made. The battery of this watch is around four years. Okay, now so let's uh, check what's inside. Watch. Okay, here is the warranty card. The watch itself. Also, okay, as you can see, this is a quite a simple design. Uh, it's a fully polished uh, stainless steel case. Fully polished. Case shape is a little bit uh, different from all those watches I bought. It's a little bit, uh, I don't know how to describe this uh, case. It looks quite uh, well made for a watch under $40. Actually, this is a $35 watch. Okay, the case back is uh, a brushed stainless steel case back looks uh, decent quality there's some information about this watch the brand name Sunflame Tokyo Japan model number made in Japan Okay, here is the uh, Super Lumilova. I think it's about the loom on this watch. We will check the loom later. Four years battery. Okay, let me check what's uh, water resistant. Okay, I didn't find any information about water resistance. Okay, no information about water resistance. That's a little bit very weird. But I think it might be Thirty millimeter, uh, thirty meters water resistance. Okay, that's all. Now let's check the watch itself. It comes with a nylon strap attached uh, with this. Uh, I'm not sure it's a. Uh, real leather or just a PU leather but I feel like a PU leather
that are quite clean, white dial. Numbers that uh, are very easy to tell the time. Our markings are all roomed on the hour hand, second hand, a minute hand, also loomed. Okay, that. Let's check the time machine with a watch. Case diameter is around 39 millimeters. Lock to lock is a uh, 45 millimeters. The lock is, uh, is uh, 20 millimeters. Okay, this is uh, a little bit uh, uh, bigger watch, I mean, in case diameter uh, for me. Uh, uh, usually, I only buy watches under uh, 38 millimeters for case diameter. But this watch actually looks quite uh, uh, gorgeous and uh, a uh, really easy to read uh, dial. Okay, now let's uh, put on my wrist. Okay, as you can see, it looks quite uh, nice. I mean, fits great on my 6.3 inch wrist. That white dial is really gorgeous. It don't look chunky or Awful because uh, because the lock to lock is only 45 millimeters. The case diameter is 39. I think this is a great watch for most people because uh, perfect uh, dimension. Dimension. The watch uh, strap is a uh, nylon strap with a little bit of leather touch, but uh, it's not bad. But I will switch to uh, some tan color little strap later. Okay, now let's uh, check the loom on this one because it says uh, super uh, luminova. Okay. Okay, that's uh, not bad. I mean, I I think they did lie. Uh, it actually looks quite bright. My only complaint is a little bit uh, small, but uh, it uh, works great. Okay, that's all. Thank you guys. If you enjoy my video, please uh, uh, leave a comment and, and subscribe. That helps me a lot. I'll see you in the next watch. Okay, now I put on a tan color uh, leather strap. That's how it looks like.